the, as I said, this meeting is um, sharing information, best practice, reviewing, and see how we can move forward. We are looking at the way forward. I think it is important at village level to involve the villagers themselves. Because somebody coming from um, whether it's the province or the district does not really know what happens in the village. It's the villagers themselves who would know who is vulnerable, who is the orphan, who is the elderly, who is the disabled. So this is why we would want them to be involved in the process, the, the owners themselves. Because if you get somebody from here or, uh, deciding who is supposed to be in the list, you might end up with the wrong people. But I believe in any community, in a Zimbabwean community, we, especially in the rural areas, people live as a community. They know what is happening next door, the next crawl and so forth. Hence, they need to involve them. But what I'm here to say is, as I said in the beginning, it's information gathering, how to improve our systems. We take note of you know, things which have been said here. The systems are not in concrete, cast in concrete. Everything is the, the dynamic. It's a matter of us listening to what has been said and seeing, reviewing our present system and see if there's need to ch change or incorporate something here and there. Because here the, the, the responsible people, the permanent secretary is here, the director of social work services is here. We are hearing and listening. We have come to listen and see how we can collaborate and move forward. And nothing is concrete, which you say, ah, this one cannot be changed. We will review and see, uh, is it really working? Is there something which needs to be improved? But inclusion, we, we must try and include the involved people, not just for food distribution, you know, other um, safety networks which we have, we need to look at them and see whether the, the, the people who are affected are involved in the selection process. So that we cannot totally eliminate, you know, some people behaving, you know, out of sync, but what we say we want to do the best, try our best to manage uh, bad practices. As for the press, I'm, I'm not a journalist, but I think uh, the paper is sold by the headline. So they will also try to get a, to be creative in coming up with a headline which will make sure the paper is sold. But sometimes when you read the headline, then read the rest of the story. Maybe they are not in sync. So maybe we need to be reporting responsibly and try to really give, info, inform and educate us some of your sentiments. All I want you to understand is government is for everyone, whatever party you belong to, yes, but you, we are the people in government. We have to look after everyone. That's what it means to be in government. We can have our own political fights wherever, but when it comes to issues of health, education, food, and so forth, government is the responsible authority. And we thank you as people enabling, facilitating, making it easier for us, especially when we have uh, liquidity challenges and uh, you, are, you, are, you are assisting us in our responsibility and I, I, I appreciate and thank that thank you for that and as I said uh, we want to have regular uh, dialogue so that we appreciate each other's challenges and what's happening and where we can improve